Hello everyone, my name is John and I'm working for Linagora's digital agency, Linda. Today I'm going to talk about platformization. Platformization is a phenomenon whereby organizations modify their structures and customs to adapt and pursue their missions in a very dynamic context. Profusion of data, spreading of IT and social networks, smartphones, enhanced accessibility, and so on. A platform relies on technologies and a management that enable companies to offer new services and to interact ever more with their associates, their clients, their suppliers, and generally speaking with all their businesses' stakeholders. Let me speak a bit about the context of platformization. Platformization emerges from the growing complexity of the corporate world that is especially due to three technological phenomena. The first of them is the increasing production of data. As you can see, data has exponentially increased since the 90s and more generally the development of computers and information technology. The second phenomenon is the enhanced computing power of all our devices that enable professionals along with private individuals to constantly make use of those data. At last, there is the communications boom that make all databases potentially connectable to each other. Let me precisely show you how platformization takes shape in everyday life. I will now ask you to focus on Samia, the young woman who is waiting crossed armed at the bus stop. She suddenly decides to invite her friend Mary for lunch. So, she sends her a message, then opens an app that permits her to choose a restaurant. She makes her choice, opts for an Italian restaurant, Papiano, and orders directly from the app. The intermediation firm that runs the app then transfers the order to Vapiano. This restaurant prepares Samia's order and next gets in touch with the delivery company it has a partnership with. The latter calls one of its couriers who himself gets the order thanks to another app and the courier then comes to take Samia's command to deliver it afterwards. Through ordering from Vapiano, Samia has resorted directly and indirectly to three companies. In that case, the platform refers to the whole structure that is not only its information system but also its internal organization and its management, which made it possible to interact with all those stakeholders being at the frontier of its activity and yet necessary for its thriving. Now let us think about a platform's functioning from its inside, namely from a company's office. We are now in a company's open space. A platform company must be organized in order to permit as many interactions as possible between its different associates, its customers, and the stakeholders it is interfaced with. All in all, the organization and the company's back-office tools must allow quick decision-making that is more often than not carried out by numerous stakeholders. Broadly speaking, those tools must be flexible and therefore adapt to the maximum of possible situations. They must be conceived so as to be able to be constantly improved. If a firm wants to develop a new functionality, whether it regards its clients or its own associates, it must be able to easily make it fit its ecosystem. At Linagora, we try to provide companies with tools that best meet the platformization's requirements. It is in that perspective that OpenPass was conceived. OpenPass is our open source platform that provides our clients with a working environment that is efficient, intuitive and flexible. When developing OpenPass, we wanted to create a tool that could always be improved. In this regard, OpenPass enables any company to freely add apps to the initial software layer. For more information about OpenPass, please visit open-pass.org. You will then be able to learn more about the platform itself, about its different functionalities and its open source community. Of course, you will also be able to download it on your own. Here ends our video about platformization. If you want to discover more about this topic, don't hesitate to read our white paper, Digital Platforms at the Core of the Organization's Transformation. For now, it is available in French, but it is going to be translated soon. You will also soon be able to download our new white paper about artificial intelligence that will be published in early 2018. Don't forget that relevant links are written in the video's description. See you very soon for another video. Goodbye.